was, uh, you know, a really perfectly good 747-400. We, we cut the top off of it, we tripled the volume, and yet when we're all said and done, the airplane flies just as high as the original, it flies almost as far as the original, and it flies just a hair slower. I mean, you think of the, of the challenges that we had in converting these large 747 airplanes into being able to, to lift this airplane around the world. One of the key pieces of the, of the build efficiency is the Dreamlifter. Bob Noble, Vice President, 787 Supplier Management. We use this airplane to transport the wing and fuselage sections of the 787 from points all around the world here to our site in Everett. My name is Kurt Kraft, Life Cycle Product Team Leader on the 787 program. We had a rather extensive study looking at all the different airplanes that existed in the world, Antonovs, C-5s, Alugas, uh, you name it. We looked at ship transportation, railroad cars. Being able to get them here in a day forced us really to go to, to an airplane solution. And since nothing else was available, uh, we were forced to go to the Dream Lifter concept. And that's uh, what the 787 is all about, right? The airplane's efficient, it's fuel efficient, efficient for the environment, and it's also efficient to build. We load the uh, sections in through the back end of the airplane. This whole back end is uh, secured with 21 locks and latches. We have a, a ground transportation, we call it a mobile tail support. Uh, it comes in and plugs into the airplane. It actually drives that tail open. With that, we have a, a very large uh, transportation device that picks up the sections. Uh, that brings it over to the back end of the airplane, and uh, those sections then made up with our tracks inside the airplane here. And uh, the whole thing is just pulled forward onto our rails. They're loaded and secured down uh, onto the airplane using that system. We anticipate building four airplanes today to support our 787 uh, rate ramp up and carry us through our production systems. It's going to be very busy. When we get up to rate, uh, these airplanes will be employed uh, literally daily. A, a real tribute to uh, innovation on the, on the teams that we've had to be able to make those changes to that airplane and to be able to get it certified and, uh, and fly. The first day that we opened the airplane tail up, word got out and I tell you, we had an audience. Uh, we must have had 3,000 people standing in that factory just gawking as we opened that tail for the first time. It was truly a spectacular sight, and you could just you could see the pride in absolutely everybody's face. People were so inspired. They were so thrilled to have been a part of this program because it really is a game changer. Every time they see this airplane, I want them to think about the airplane that's inside there. Soon, you too will experience air travel like you have always wished it could be. In the months ahead, we will be sharing this exciting turning point in aviation with you. So please, sit back, relax, and prepare yourself for the future of aviation. The Boeing 787 Dreamliner. How will you travel through life?